Hey everybody, it's Sandwich. Welcome back. This is Knee Deep in Z-Doom. This is the original one that came out in 2007. Not the vanilla D-Make that came out recently. But, yeah. this uh, They threw in the kitchen sink all the features of Z-Doom at the time. And, uh... In a world where you are the Doom guy. Situation negative! <laughs> so this stuff is pretty amusing. Got a little cinematic intro on the title screen. That one man was left with no choice but to go in and do unto others before they do unto others. Do unto others before they do unto you. <laughs> you are Jesus Christ and you're on Mars. Relive the nightmare. Relive the suspense. I like that it's the cyber demon walk sound there. Relive Phobos. Knee deep in Z do. Yeah, so this one a Kako order like 2007. I think this is the final version that was uploaded in like 2012. But uh, yeah, there was obviously a, D a vanilla version of this that came out recently. I want a CAC award as well, so, um... Or was it a CAC award or an honorable mention? I don't know, but, uh, I have not played this before. This is for Doom 1. And yeah. So here's a cool thing. You can activate action locators to find areas that are not switches. So I just hit it, and look at that. We've got, like, an arrow. Uh, but this is kind of... I, I loaded this up for a second just to check it out. We've got this... Uh, I guess I arrived in this strange vehicle here. Three secrets, 117 monsters, okay. And, um, this just closes this. I, you know... Oh, I can't get out. Great. Yeah. Um, now I'm blind. I just loaded up to make sure things were working. First we got the Duke Nukem style. Uh, security cameras. And, uh, as you can see, I've got... I've got casings ejecting from my pistol. That's uh, that's something. No reloading though. They didn't go that far, thankfully. I just realized there's a little there's like oh, item rotations are on. Right, right, right. This this file did have a couple PK3s in it that added item. For a second I thought that was voxels and I'm just like, I'm not playing voxel dude. That's a new thing. Um, oh, look at this. Very... This is cool. Very elaborate hangar. Look at this. A little bit more verticality. We've got windows now. Um, I lowered a force field. Wait a minute. Not actually sure where that was. The ambient computer hum. Uh, shotgunners replaced by zombie men, so actually slightly easier. Oh, I see. Interesting. Force fields. What just shook? Was that a barrel that blew up? I'm not sure. Um. So I. Th what the hell's blowing up? Uh. This is an interesting thing because I know some people have criticized- well, okay, so even the wiki page, something, there was something that was just like, yeah, people criticized it when it released. Just for, you know, maybe going a little bit too hog wild in the features, but obviously this was an earlier... Okay, there's just stuff blowing up somewhere. You know, they were, they, they were including lots of, uh, features. Like, it's kind of interesting the way that, you know... There was that early spurt of, like, let's use all the Xenum features and stuff, and then I feel like, uh, you know, the community's kind of pulled back and it has preferred classic stuff more. Like, Xenum is actually taking a back seat, uh, which is kind of, it's interesting that people are like, yeah, we can do all this stuff, but we actually just like the classic gameplay. Oh, that's a funny, that's a funny rotation there. Look at that. Okay, guys, I'm reliving the nightmare, and look at this. Wow, that looks cool, actually. Just, like, 
melting intestine. Interesting that Hell's already leaking through, though. You don't really see that so much in the original hangar. Um, yeah, I, you know, it's always fun to see stuff that, like, reinvents the classic levels, and this is a lot more elaborate than what I usually see in that regard. Looks like the... Oh, is that a... Interesting. That's like a... That's like an SS Trooper style uh, rapid fire zombie man. I thought he was a shotgunner for a second, but he wasn't red, so they've actually just added a little bit of a... another tier of enemy, which I actually like. I, I, I actually like the SS as an enemy. Ooh, just ran out there. I didn't drop a clip. Oh, there we go. Nice. Nice, uh... Skybox. Nice, like, open roof area. Uh, very, uh... I feel like I could have gone another direction there. I wonder if that would have given me something... Uh, you know what? Why don't we go back to, like, where you usually go? Um... Oh, I need the red key to go to, to the direction that you usually do in this level. Okay. Uh, is this just... Do you need to hit the switch for that one? I always like tech bases with like a natural area around them. That's a cool way to sort of accent it. Um, damn. I don't actually know if you're allowed to jump in this. I mean, since it's all the Zedium features, you might expect that, but... I didn't necessarily see that in the text file. So, uh... So I honestly cannot find information on whether jumping is allowed, but I do have it set to default and it's letting me jump. So... Hey. That could be a hint. Uh, that's a secret, okay. Um, but yeah, I really wanted to play this before playing the vanilla demake version, uh, which, but I'd love to check that out for sure after this. Because the vanilla demake does not only just make it functional, but it adds some cool, cool weird story stuff uh, that I've well I've been told as much. Um, is that a shotgun box? Ah, I don't quite have a shotgun yet. I swear I read something interesting on the wiki that I wanted to bring up, and now I forget now that I'm playing. Um, now, I guess we'll see if uh, at some point, perhaps, uh, I will see something that seems like it needs jumping. Hmm. But uh, definitely making me... Unless I missed it somewhere, this is definitely a uh, pistol-heavy first map. This guy is... Ooh! I slide right up the stairs, too. Uh... Still can't get out there. This is just... Okay, this is just the other direction you can go. Alright, gotcha. And I'm still looking for that shotgun. Especially now that we got that box. It's the yellow key door. Where is the, um... Around this way. Ha <laughs> ha! Oh my god. Oh no! It's so dark in here. I think there's a flashlight. Wow, look at that guy go! Twirling, twirling towards freedom. Um... 
It's a nice little shotgun reveal, you know. I, you know, I didn't even think about it, but I might be playing this continuous because I, you know, they might have sort of. I'm guessing they sort of balance for that. It's like a, you know, the classic experience, uh, and a lot of a lot of stuff, and especially from that era, I feel like is going for that. You can see, got these are, I believe, stone imps. I think I was read on the wiki. They take a couple, couple more shots. Let's try to conserve. Oh. That shell landed on top of that pinky. That was cute. You wore it as a hat for a second there. Um, oh, is that the outdoor area? Nice. Okay, so this is this... Okay. It's actually showing us that we can... Go there. So what can be destroyed with a seismic bomb? What? Guess that doesn't include my pistol. Okay. Oh, I've got the yellow key now, so... Oh. Uh, it's interesting. I, I've actually played uh, another another elaborate E1-M1 remake that I saw was a, um, a Ragnatron Invasion that I played on my channel, which had some Doom 64 stuff added. Technically, that took place in the future. So it wasn't necessarily... It was like a future version of Hangar. But, um... That's another cool one to check out if you want a nice... Elaborate version. Gotta watch out for these guys. That, since they will... Continuously fire at you. Get up there. Uh, there's the ticket. There's my fat ticket out of there. Um, now this did, this was an updated version that came out in I think in 2012, but. You know, I'm not 100% sure of, like, the compatibility with newer GZ Doom, but everything seems to be working out here. Uh, this looks like a jump right here, folks. This is, uh... Yeah. The F is that? Oh, that's a... <laughs> this is a C4 on it. I got the Seismic Bomb. Interesting. Now, I don't think there's an inventory system. I'm guessing I just used that. Um, I think I have my inventory stuff bound, it just, uh, yeah, I'm guessing it's, it's interesting they didn't go hog wild with, like, the inventory stuff. Oh, shit. I did it. I won. Alright, so jumping confirmed, I think. Um... Got fog effects, hazardous radiate. Oh, that's cool. Kind of has a sheen of radiation fog. Still don't know how to get out. I guess through that way. All right. Oh, look at that. We got like whoa! -ho -ho! Did not see that coming. Yeah. Lots of... Whoa! Shadow imp things. That's cool. Whoa. This is honestly doing... This is... This is ten maps, but with with the amount they're adding... That looks cool. There's some cool architecture here. With the amount they're adding, um... It's actually more than I expected. Pretty cool. I'm sure a lot of you have played this before. It's pretty old, but, you know. Sometimes it's fun to see someone else play through it. Uh. Oh. Wow. 
Cool. Just regular zombie men, don't have to worry too much there. to see. Ooh, there's more down there. I'm gonna have to conserve my shotgun a bit. Up in there, maybe? I can jump. I've gotta keep reminding myself I can jump. I heard heard something. Here. Uh okay. Wasn't sure what to look at in front of me or the the security cam. What's this? It's just like nothing. That might that might not open. I'm playing this with the just the vanilla, what's called the vanilla light. Not sure if that's best for this. This is a bit dark, but I think it's kind of supposed to be. Oh my god, I keep forgetting. Just deep. That's just more than knee deep. Oh. Is that not hurting me, really? Oh, medikit. Alright. Ooh, okay, so. We probably opened up that door back there. Oh, this area, yeah. Oh, no shotgun here. Okay, not a secret anymore. take a couple shots. Okay, I think I opened up the side door there, I'm guessing. Very cool floors. Um, oh, is I, I think it sucked the radiation out. Let's see if we can get outside here. Maybe there's that mega armor. Oh no. Uh, no armor out here this time. Oh, there's shotgun shells. Well, that's actually pretty useful on this map. Um, what do we have here? <laughs> just a just, uh, little a hell accents. I do like this animated slime. Nice. Cool the way this is reinterpreting these areas, putting them in different places, building onto it, adding lots of extra detail. Doesn't open. Hmm. Huh. Well. Uh, 
Uh, thing is broken. Oh no. Wait a minute. How the hell do I open that sucker? I have no idea. I mean, this is the furthest I got. Like a switch somewhere? I might have to look around a bit. I somehow did not notice <laughs> this area right here. Now we have to get around the door. Oh, hello. Looks like I missed a couple secrets, but I got all the monsters and a uh, pretty elaborate map. Not sure I want to look for those secrets. Oh, look at this. Oh, that's really cool, actually. Huh. Wait a minute. Change menu forward, backward, makes. So what? This is neat. They actually went to the trouble of, like, making this Doom Cube version of Intermission. Uh, view cumulative stats? Uh, okay, so you can, like, oh, look at that. Uh, this is just for stats for everything. View stats for player. Health collected. Huh. View time report. Oh, this is neat. I'm actually kind of surprised we don't see more stuff like this. I mean, I, I I like this. That's a lot of work. I think this took a while to make. But, uh... Locating next target area. Acquiring image. Prepare for insertion. Oh yeah, baby. I know what the ladies like. Yeah, so I'm going to be playing this continuous because uh, it kind of feels like it's more designed for that. Oh, shotgunners. Uh, I really like this level in the normal game, so uh, this is a really cool interpretation. I wasn't sure how I feel about this. Sometimes, sometimes I'm not big on like the full Z-Doom suite of features just for the sake of it, but this seems very well done so far. Hello? Anybody up here? Oh. Lots of, like, little ambient sounds everywhere. Chain gun. Should have the uh, indicators on. I believe the uh, action indicators are only for things that aren't switches. So it's to help you out. It's a medikit, though. Right, they look a bit different. Um, is the secret still here? Backpack. The switch is broken. Find another way out. Subverting your expectations already. Cool. All right, what's what's this little room here? Green card. I need a green card. Or am I immigrating into there? Or what, what's going? On? Oh, now oh, we got some hell. I just realized the chain gun is behind is is behind that force field. It's not out here necessarily. Uh, we'll see if I can conserve my shotgun a bit. Whoa, never mind. Whoa! Whoa, that's a... What is that, a Vore missile from Quake? That was... homing extremely close. We gotta be careful. Those are not the stone imps. That's Those are... weird-ass imps. Thankfully, these are just regular ones. Again, very cool. Like, open sky. This, this tech base, you know, it has a, it's, it has a lot of light. Natural light, I, I, you know, it's really 
really nice of them to uh, include that in a space like this. Great, great working environment for the UAC. Um, other than the, the demonic invasions and stuff. But it's a small price to pay. Reminds me of the uh, skylights in... Um, is it... Ion? No, it was the John Romero's Daikatana um, developer studio where they had this... They were in a skyscraper with a skylight and it was so goddamn hot they'd have to like... Yeah, they didn't think that through. <laughs> That's what this is. Alright, well... Damn. So, I've got the red key now, but there's like all these... Apparently new ways to get stuff. I can have a look around. I'm guessing that green room might actually have uh, something. Like a... I don't know. Switch or something. I think now that we have a backpack, we can actually just use the shotgun to our heart's content. See the imp balls have a bit of a smoke trail. I don't have a chainsaw yet, but maybe I can get it in here. This is such a good level. I mean, I love the even the original. I love the I love the. I mean, it's not. It's a hot start in a very easy sense, but. Then this open, like, maze area is actually pretty cool. It's all dark. It's a great level. Wow. This place is full up with pinkies this time, though. Some neat ambient computer sounds here. I wonder if I can just get the chainsaw over here. Seems promising. Interesting that they sort of like... I guess because they, they assume you like know... You know, all the secrets. So... They kind of like, they're making it more interesting. Like stuff that was a secret, they're just making progression. And then they're adding like new stuff, which is probably a good way to do it. Cause otherwise it's gonna be a bit easy. Cause like right here, I don't actually, the reactor is still active. Force fields are on. Oh, do I have to actually power down the nuclear reactor? That's for progression. That's actually a cool idea. Laying off the theme of the original level. I did, uh, while I was paused, I changed the, uh, light. Where's open remotely? I changed the, uh, the lighting mode in GZ Doom to software. It's a little, I think that's the one that's actually accurate. It's a little brighter than the one that's called vanilla. Um. Obviously the... The uh, computer sound is really nice here. It really lends something, an atmosphere to this. I wonder. Oh. Where's that backpack? Probably not where you expect it. Make sure I'm not missing something here. Just this whole area. Okay. Let's go back. Oh, I'm opening that. Okay. Looks like you might be able to get... Well, you think you can get out that way here? No, there's like so many computer panels. They're all lighting up. So that's not really helping me so much. Oh. Let's make our way to that door. Oh. What's going 
going on in here? Cool. Shutting down reactor core. I don't think I want to fall off here. Power level minus 10%. That's uh, very little power. Uh, I'm going to check this out. That's instant death. Don't jump in the reactor, kids. Alright. Um, so there's... that. Re so that force field back there. There's also the force field over here. Oh, and there's the force field with the chain gun. I'm guessing all of that stuff is down now. Huh. Interesting. Well, let's go back, see if we can get that chainsaw. If it's, if it's still there. Aren't those like... Well, I don't know if those are specifically half-life sounds or... Is that a line dev trigger there? Take about three shots, huh? Oh. Whoa! Jeez Louise. They do the lost soul lunge. I wasn't expecting that. I wonder if you can even chainsaw those guys. I don't know. Here's the uh, d fast food delivery window there. Um, what am I looking at here? It's kind of funny that there's a reflection. I don't know if I even remember that area, but I, I may have had to actually, um, that might actually be the progression to even end the level that I just didn't go to. But yeah, we gotta, we gotta freaking worry about those, those Blood pinkies are bad news. I'm going to say you probably can't or probably don't want to chainsaw them. Okay, nice. Finally got this thing. That's a secret. Sure. Uh, were there any... There weren't any, like, force fields around here, were there? I still haven't figured out how to get out there. Damn. Probably has, like, uh, well, it, I saw that it has the, uh, soul sphere, but... I wonder if there's more. Whoa, look at this. It struts. shells. How is there an armor up there? Um. Oh, I can change out of these guys. Now, can we swim through there? I thought maybe you could, like, Oh. Well, we can. I don't know if it's worth it, because I don't need the armor. I was sort of more interested in, like... More than enough armor. Hmm. This is going to be a thing. <laughs> oh, jeez. Get out of there. Things home too well.
Whoa! Guy died in style. Damn, there really is a lot of secret stuff. There's a blood pinky over there, we gotta watch out for that. In fact, we should probably use the chain gun to stun those. Oh. I believe this Z dude, this Spectre filter is more accurate. It is it's like a scaled up version of Vanilla. The exit. Wow. Oh, these guys do the homing shuffle. They shoot j pumpkin. You don't want to go in there. I wonder where that green key is. There's a blue door. I'm. You know what? I'm guessing we can't just go to the exit here. It's a yellow key. Yeah, we got this whole new area. Cool. Got a shot off. Hello? This is definitely going to be. Oh boy. Looks like. I think. I think you get. Yeah, I think I'm stopping their lunge by shooting them that way. Probably for the best. What did that do for me exactly? Uh, I would open this. Okay. Uh oh. Well, you know, this variety of imps is kind of cool. Not just the same old, same old. Supposed to go down here? I never. I didn't. I. I. I thought this was a secret. I. Uh, I uh, might need to return. The hell am I? Wow, I'm way back. You know that green key might be a secret. Oh, this is a secret. Oh, look at this, like, water tank thing. It's kind of cool. These guys shoot projectiles, or are they just... These guys just... Yeah. Um... So the blue... Uh-oh, that's not good. So the blue key's a bit of a secret, then? Uh, why do I want this rad suit, though? I mean, I don't know, maybe this is a, like a rad suit nukage trap, no? Alright. Go back. Probably shouldn't have taken that rad suit, I guess, but... Anything up here? I... Oh! Damn it. Oh, I can't actually get... Can't necessarily get. Oh, what the collision? Oh god, it's like the collision's like. Okay, that's actually blocked. Oh no. Interesting. This whole section of the base is just completely added on. Like, doesn't seem it's really based on anything. I 
picked up the key there. Oh, jeez. Oh, jeez. I'm going to tuck myself in this corner and not let go of this trigger. Because even the chainsaw is not going to be good against these guys. I assume... very well. Got the yellow key there. Uh, there's cool lighting there. Or, uh, you know, light fixtures. Five out of nine secrets, but still haven't found that green key. But now I have the key that goes to the exit. Hmm. What's going on here? Just mucus flows. Wait a minute. Oh, that's just like a silent teleport thing. Okay. Uh, well. I bet this isn't just the exit. Oh. Maybe it is. Anybody down there? Oh. Damn, did I really miss- I missed a bunch of stuff? Okay, guys, I was looking around and I saw this on the map, and it looks like this is going to be something. And... This is probably where you want to get that rad suit. Anything in there? No. Okay, and then we can get this. Now, is that all I get from here? Couldn't quite jump over there. Damn. There's more to be discovered. Was not able to find much. I filled in the map a bit more and killed a couple more guys, but... All the secrets I could save, and the fact that we're playing continuous, you know, I, I don't want to cheat and, like, find the stuff, so... Let's just see what I can do myself. Let's again look at the sexy intermission screen. More people should use this thing. This is cool. But yeah, another great uh, level. I don't. I don't really need to. I'm not really interested in looking at all these stats, but they're cool for people who are interested in in it. Locating next target area. Acquiring image. It's a giant CD-ROM. Toxin refinery. Preparing for insertion. Now here's a map. Now this is a goddamn map. I mean, every episode, every every map needy in the deep, deep in the dead is uh, fantastic. But the first three are, I mean, the the E1M2 and three are special. Oh wow, this place is open from the beginning. That's pretty neat. Oh, and there's... Oh, look at that. We've got like a dead guy with a... The helmet light. Uh, what the hell am I looking at there? There's rocks. Uh, that looks like it goes down. Let's look in here. Oh, shit. A lot of these guys. Um, they don't really know what to do with this indent in the floor, though. They're kind of jitting around. Maybe he's, maybe that's the design idea, so they can't necessarily get to you. Which really makes that easier. I'm guessing I can't just go to the secret level from here. Maybe that'll open up? Who knows? But, uh, we've got that door. I'm not sure that opens, so... Check this out. Whoa! 
I got chainsawed in the back. I didn't know these guys were a thing. That's kind of cool. Basically, zombie man pinkies. Whoa! I'm sorry, was that a rocket trooper? I'm, uh, I'm scared. There are rocket, rocket marines in this. That's... This is neat. There's a whole underground area here. What did I just pick up? What? Is that a pogo stick? Like a jackhammer? It's like a mining area. That makes sense, I guess. That still hit me. Yeah, those are like boar missile style. I'm not sure if I... Maybe that door was locked up there. I'm not sure. I should probably just test out normal progression uh, first. Toxic substance detect activate secondary pump. Purify the area. Right on, brother. Yeah, I mean, some of this like cave architecture is not the most elaborate, and it's a lot of one texture, but I don't know. It's like I feel like if this was just a regular map, these this area would be plain. But I, it's because it's like this additional area added on. It's kind of cool. We've got goat men. They fire anything? These guys might just walk up to you and give you business. They have a lot of health. I think they just run up and punch the shit out of you, I guess. Uh, I'm guessing... Yeah, yeah, yeah. These are like Hell Knights, basically. Except, they're punchy Hell Knights. Check this out first. Ooh, chain gunners. They have a nice redesign too. I didn't realize this is this is the Doom One IWAD, but it looks like they've just added Doom Two style stuff, which is uh, cool. But I don't expect something like an arch bomb necessarily. Natural choke point here. Oh shit, these guys. I want your pogo stick, man. Um. I guess this maybe was pistol start considered uh, with the way that they trapped that chain gun there. Need an orange card? How do I get an orange card? I'm just making shit up now. Oh yeah, you need like a, I don't know, you need like a mauve card to get in here. Something. Oh, hi. I mean, I can just pick these guys off my leisure this way. Get more health. This doesn't hurt. We got a little weird, probably a Z Doom thing there. Used about how I got here. So we could go in this way, or we could just jump through the window, which 
Oh, let me get the drop on guys, so... Can I see everything here? Oh. I remember that a lot of these are deep water. Locked. Access denied. Got a remote lock to disengage. You got an orange card. I think there was another thing. I'm not gonna try chainsawing those guys. Chain gunner. here. <laughs> Sorry, I don't want to disturb whatever you guys are doing here, but looking longingly into that soldier's eyes. Quite a few monsters in this map. Might take me a little while. Probably should have stopped. This is going to be a little over an hour. If I'm near some cover, at least I can... Those things aren't quite as homing as war missiles, I think. Boy, would I like a rocket launcher for those guys up there, though. I'll, like, just do that so I don't... ...accidentally get shot there. Just want to see if there's anything here. How was that sound? It's just you. Get, get in here. Uh, hello? I should face the right direction. Oh. So I can't get up there yet. I don't see any secret walls. Hey, can I... I'm not sure I can get these guys any other way here. Maybe I'll just take them out right now. Only take a couple hits. It's not open. Okay. Damn it. Actually running low on bullets. Oh! It's not good if I'm running low on bullets. Guys just like repeatedly lunge into you. Can't stop it. Oh, am I gonna secondary pump? Nice little animation there. It's cool. Right, I needed the pump for the sump pump for something. Area decontaminated access plan. 
thought it was somewhere else that I needed it. Um. God, this whole area is like. This whole area is a bit of a maze. I don't know. Okay, I can use this. As long as there aren't any lunger. lunger pinkies. Oh shit. I'm sure the purpose of these satyrs, like, kind of just walk at you. They're not really dangerous. Projectile might have made them more interesting. Okay, this is back here. It's down here. Eleven secrets in this one. Uh oh. Oh. This thing came down, I guess. Um Oh, I need an orange key for that that area over there. Uh the silent teleport thing. I still don't have a key, so, and this is the way I got out. I may have missed something there. Did I not? The heck? Oh, I missed that the first time. Was... Okay, I never tried that door over there. Now, can I just go in there or is it locked? You just go in here. Which, uh, this has had a nice little green upgrade. I wonder if I needed. What if I needed to do the pump thing to like get through this area? Or if I, uh, I, I swear I saw something that needed that pump and I can't quite remember. Let's see what's up here though. Is this still open? Oh, right. I, uh... <laughs> I already took care of them. Nice. I'm guessing... Wait a minute. Did I not hit the switch here? Is there... I forgot to hit the switch there. Yeah, we got this whole area. I could actually use a soul sphere as well. Whoa. Low on bullets again. But high on shotgun shells. Access denied. Disable security locks to open emergency hatch. What am I looking at? I wonder if there's still a, uh, a walkover line there. I didn't hear anything. Security locks, huh? 
I didn't hear any walkover lines. Um, so that's obviously a bit different. <laughs> Those computers are... Oh. Oh, I just disabled them. They were right next to me. Emergency hatch accessible. Is that in here? Or is that? There's like a light. Uh, I guess I open... I'm trying to figure out where that is. It's right there. What? What? Oh. How do I get up there? There's a crate on there. Oh, come on. Don't do this to me. I can't jump crouch in there either. Is that a walkover? Can't, you can't just tease me that way, guys. Come on. Maybe that's how I come out? The heck? Well, you can always come back and try to figure that out. Uh, nice. Oh, I got two of eleven. Here. Whoa. They are in the ceiling. Lock. That this might be. Uh, I, I mean, I mean, you can, you can. Um, actually, yeah, I think that was a soft lock. I thought, it, I thought it was maybe that I was crouch toggling, but nope. Um. What did that do? in here. I'm guessing something here. Is that a rocket launcher? Do I have to go in the in the slime to get there? It's a window I can't actually Wait, did I see something? What's that? I can't that looks like an explosive barrel, but it's just a thing. Alright. Ball damage? What the hell? There's definitely some mysterious stuff going on here. Speaking of which... I believe there is a, I just realized, I believe there's a super shotgun in this, so it definitely does go further with the Doom 2 stuff. I know because there was a screenshot. Ah, oh, this area. Oh, nice, this is a lot more opened up. Um, 
Wow. Guessing I wanna... I guess I, I want to get that suit and maybe explore that outer area, but let's like check this area out first. I'm sure I'll be coming back here. Nice. Remember this? Also, this trap is pretty well known. What are they going to do with it though? Anything? Ah! <laughs> Goat men are out. Oh, they're gonna, they're just, it's gonna keep opening up. Here's the thing the goat men aren't that dangerous, though. It's gotta be more, right? time. What the hell? Oh, it's this lion guy. Interesting. I think this guy can ref... Yeah, with his shield up, he reflects bulls. Wow, that was a very smooth death animation. That was interesting. What the heck? Hello? Alright, well, we got a blue key out of that, um... I feel like I wanna... swim around out here and maybe... see if there's anything interesting. Uh, maybe there's like a... Maybe there's something to see around here. on this side. Here's the other one. Aha, a tunnel. Two tunnels. Ah. Yes. The first rocket launcher. Now that, that was worth finding for sure. I might not find the other stuff, but... In fact, I wonder if you can get to the secret level. Because there's that orange key, right? Hmm. It'd be nice to get to military base. But... I just might not be able to find it. Oh, no. Back this way. Key. I need that blue key for the other side, right? Guessing, I'm not actually sure. Were these um, force fields, maybe? All right. Okay. Just gonna have a bunch of. Open. Is there another bullet box? Oh, um. I should have saved first. Let's just roll with it. There's a secret chainsaw. Wait a minute. 
Oh, that looks like it's another... Yeah, that looks like it's another thing down there, but I'm gonna take too much damage. Power level not sufficient activate backup generator in mines. To go back to the mines? Apparently I missed something down there. Huh. Did I not open this? Oh, this area. Oh no, chainsaw boys. open remotely. Don't want that barrel next to me. Ouch. I have 15 rockets. Might as well hang on to them for a bit, though. Can't actually get onto there. <laughs> that was the sound of it. Let's actually just do a save here. Okay, these guys don't lunge at least. I'm... I think they're just beefier. Yeah, I can't just chainsaw them normally. Takes a little time. Not seeing any movable walls. Although there is like a, a slime tunnel that goes down there, but I don't have a rad suit. Oh. It's up there. It's like a megasphere or something? Oh shit. You know what? These guys are a bit beefy. Uh, can't really get. This feels pretty jank. I'm, I'm gonna Skyrim my way up this hill here. <laughs> no, I'm guessing this is like a teleport or something. Okay, I'm guessing we open this. Oh, jeez. Better watch out, they've got robotic legs. Ooh, that guy's arm just went flying. Nice. Oh, the orange key! The hell is that up there? I'm guessing that's a Megasphere, but it's like a weird loop and doom guy face. Uh, let me just see. Can I get up here? Can get onto here. It's not from like below. Um, I'm not sure you can really do anything from up here. Let me just uh, make sure, because like I didn't quite make that jump. Ah. Is that blocked? That might be blocked. Yeah, that seems blocked. It's kind of kind of funny. I, that really seemed like it would be something. Maybe it is, but I just can't quite get it. Um so I got an orange key. Whoa! Now, like I saw before, there are a couple of... Yeah, it looks like there's definitely stuff under there. I th That might be where the chainsaw was, but like... There just aren't the rad suits for that. Um, this still isn't open. I guess those red light- those red lights will probably turn green. 
orange key. Where was that? This is the big ass map. Uh. Jeez. You seen an orange key door, sir? He's having a nap. Well, it said something about going down to the mines, and maybe that's where the. I can't. I can't see the orange door on the map. That's that's one problem. Probably, possibly because Z Doom doesn't know how to show that. I also still don't know how to get up there. Uh, let's go back to the mines then. I mean, is it an orange door? A secret area? No. Going back down, folks. There. Oh, is that it? Right there. Yeah, yeah. Wait a minute. There's a red door. Oh no. There. Oh, there's the orange there. I had a mega armor. Some crazy ass progression right here. For E1M3, I mean. It's it's. Access to backup generator granted. Here's the thing. This level is so big that, like, at one point, I I knew what that meant. Right now, it's been a while. I mean, it's interesting. There's arrows on the, on the mini-map. Which are possibly telling me. But, um, let's get the mega armor. What the heck? Mega armor was like... I don't know what... Oh, that... There's a red key open now. Okay. Can we get... Is it where there's a red door here? Fire, uh... What's that? Man, there's, um... get anywhere. I can look at the weird shadows bugging out. That's about it. Oh, the, okay, so that... Okay, yeah, you see there's like a little orange-ish looking... Okay, so they have accounted for that in, a, in an interesting, in a pretty useful way. Not one that I typically see. Those guys... System unoperable. Activate both power coils first. You need a red car to open this door. Excuse me? Power coils? What is happening? Oh no. Guys, I might be... I might be in trouble here. There's so much going on in this map. Oh, damn. Okay, so yeah, I think I finally found it. It is at the bottom of these stairs, and I guess the key was opened here. Um, but like I said, it's kind of hard when there, there's like several different pieces of progression to, to remember. Um, I honestly did not remember that for a while. Uh, but yeah, it's all in the mines here. And... Just to find your way around, it's... I, could, I think I could see why some people would have some problems with this set because of... Levels like this... 
There might be a way to do this level and, and not have you get lost, but it's a... Uh, I think I didn't necessarily do it in the order that they were expecting. Uh, even to get around to this thing is around this way. Some of the like this area looks the same as that other one. Uh, I think maybe this is gonna help with the power coils. Yeah, there we go. The power coils thing made me think maybe it like was more than just finding the red key. Generator activated, power level optimal, so now I think I can go to the exit. I'll see you there. Okay, I'm, I'm making my way back, and, uh... Oh, they have actually... Sent some stuff my way here. Ouch. I've seen these guys before. I guess this is just Realm 667, but... Oops, I saw these guys in, uh... Project Brutality, actually. I don't remember them, their arms animating quite that smoothly, though. Um, now, I had been thinking of looking for secrets, but honestly, this level's been, like, long enough. Very much a little bit too long in the in the tooth already. So let's see if we can just get, get out of here. Even finding my way back is... Okay, there we go. Oh, I'm so beefy. Uh oh. Damn it. Hello? That's the exit. Huh, it almost seems like you can squeeze in, but no. Grab a couple health bonuses for the road. All right. Uh, looks like we're taking the tram. Half Life style. All right. Uh. That's going to do it for this episode. Let's see what we have in store next time. Something called... What's this called? Acquiring Image. Command Control. Okay, now we're going to start in this tram, and this is for next time, so... Stay tuned. I hope you're enjoying this one. Uh, it's going to be cool to play through this and the vanilla D make at some point as well, which has some some new stuff going on. It probably fixes some of the progression stuff. So uh, I'll see you next time for more of this. Goodbye.